Hello and welcome to this tutorial in Anime Studio. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make an animated character that speaks and use it on video background for a short commercial. Uh, so first need to come out here to Serif Draw Plus and pick out a frog. Here's a frog in the gallery. And then ungroup it and delete the mouth because we're going to be using a mouth from Anime Studio. And I'll transport the frog as a transparent PNG so that the video will go through all around the frog. Call it frog. And then go back to Anime Studio and import the frog picture. Now I could go up here to import an uh, image and grab the image or just drag it from a folder here to get it in and now it's there. Um, so what we want to do first is make a group layer to hold the frog and the mouth so that they move around in uh, one layer and drag the frog PNG in there and now we'll go out and get a mouth for the frog so click on the frog uh, picture first and then go out to file import and props and mouth sets and finally we're looking for Liz mouths and pick the one uh, that is titled Liz mouth front and notice you can't see it you have to zoom out a little bit and it's way up here move it into position and scale it up a little bit you have to move it around and get it into position. Maybe that's a little too big. And then rotate it just a bit. And put it into position. Now the reason why that I selected the frog PNG layer first and then went out and got the uh, mouth is because when you do it that way it will automatically put anything you add into the uh, layer that the frog layer is in so it automatically went into frog layer so now if I move this around the whole frog goes with the mouth or the mouth goes with the frog okay now that that's in there uh, we'll go out and get the audio file and drop it in and it comes in and the fireworks uh, movie and the fireworks movie has to be underneath the frog, so I'll drag it under there. Not putting it into the frog layer, because we don't want it to, if we move the frog around, the video goes with it. And then zoom and a little, make the video a little larger. And play it and see what we have here. Hi, are you ready for the 4th of July? Okay, that's fine. Maybe just a little bit more. Okay, that's fine. Now you can hear the audio layer playing, but the mouth isn't moving. And the reason why I did it like that is because I want to go into the sequencer and move this file around before I apply it to the mouth so that I won't have to deal with de deleting uh, keyframes later. So I'll just time this out first. Hi, are you ready for the Sounds like I got it. Uh, you can move this around a little bit and time it out. Maybe it was better just the other way. Hi, are you ready for the port? Yeah, that's okay. So now that that's in position and the video is playing in the background, I get the frog here into position, click on it, and scale him down or her down. Hi, are you ready for the Fourth of July? Okay. And now that that's done, uh, now the uh, lips can be synced to the narration. I'll come in here to Liz Mouth uh, Front and double click and go to Switch and select the uh, How Are You Ready. Now you see the audio from the fireworks movie uh, can also be synced to the mouth, but we'll be using this one. 
click OK and then we'll zoom in here and see what we got. Okay. Hi, are you ready for the Fourth of July? So now the mouth is um, animated and the keyframes are set so that it looks like it's uh, speaking. Hi, are you ready for the Fourth of July? And now we have this small commercial that uh, we can render out here to. Uh, flash or uh, AVI put it on DVD or anything like that put it on the web and this concludes this tutorial on how to make an animated character speak and thank you and see you in the next tutorial bye now